The Rotary Club's top honour has been awarded at the South Sea Castle Club for the first time in five years, unusually to a non-Rotarian. A host of guests, including Portsmouth's Lord Mayor, were invited along to the ceremony, as well as our very own Shan Robbins. Please note there is some flash photography in her report. Named after the founder of Rotary, the Paul Harris Fellowship is Rotary International's top honour. Steeped in history, the award honours Rotarians who have made an outstanding commitment to charity and Rotary. It is highly unusual for the award to be given to a non-Rotarian, but the club found former serviceman Lee Spencer so inspirational they wanted him recognised for an enduring legacy of charitable fundraising and helping others. As a Royal Marine, Lee had served in Northern Ireland, Iraq and three times in Afghanistan before losing his right leg while helping others after a crash on the M3. Oh, it's probably really rubbish and destroyed, but I'm sorry, I was just a bit, just so show just a bit blown away by uh, getting it, so I wasn't expecting it. He came and done a talk last year and um, the fact that he was in the Royal Marines and got through all, that, all those years and then just for a, tra tra a tragic accident that he helped, uh, that he lost a limb through that. And even then, he still managed to tell someone what to do, and he's come through that, and since then, he's done a lot of charity work for other people, and it's just amazing. Since his accident, Lee has run marathons, run across the Atlantic, and is planning more incredible challenges for charity. He's just a truly outstanding character. And the Paul Harris Fellowship is about outstanding service. I mean, they're not given out lightly. So we save an award um, from such an auspicious bunch of fundraisers and people who do so much for the community. It's really humbling um, to be included in their number and then honoured in this way. So like, you know, quite speechless about it. And, you know. yeah, it's a huge honour. I mean, I, I received mine for services to uh, uh, Global Youth Services uh, some years ago. Um, and like I say, it's, it's not something that's given lightly. You know, you, as a club, we, we have to donate $1,000 um, to the Rotary Foundation, and the majority of that money actually goes to end polio. There are only 16 members of the Rotary Club, and until now, only eight of the Paul Harris Fellowships have been awarded in its 29-year history. The last award was five years ago, but not only was an award made to Lee Spencer, but also to the current president, Ken Evans. With Ken, obviously, he helps anyone he can in the communities when they need help with something, with carers, with anyone, charity work, anything at all. So it's just recognition and a thank you for the work that they do. I don't even measure up closely to what Lee has achieved. It's all for, I know it's for different reasons, but to, to be part of arranging this evening for a, a gentleman like Lee Spencer was a, was a real privilege. Lee is a crew member of Team Britannia and will be undertaking the round-the-world powerboat record attempt in October. Meanwhile, he's also planning rowing across the Atlantic for the Royal Marines Charity and the Endeavour Fund. That's part of the Royal Foundation. At the moment, my day job really is putting together my next project, which is rowing from uh, continental Europe to continental America, um, solo and unsupported, and that will be happening in January. This is Shan Robbins. For that's Solent.